hi dear Aries a very very good afternoon to you guys this is Anjali Tarot and this is a general love reading for all the Aries Sun Moon Venus rising keep in mind this is general it might or might not resonate with you at the first place the second thing the roles can be reversed anytime third thing this is a reading from 1st till the 10th of June so let's start your partner's current feelings for you right now are Aries let's see okay five of wands somebody's conflict is in conflict so uh, right now your partner is going to some kind of inner conflict they are fighting with themselves or there are too many people involved in the situation right now with you with them within the connection so there is some kind of conflict there is some kind of issues going on in their feelings right now fighting with themselves fighting with the feelings might be so let me clarify the five of wands let's see Knight of Pentacles and the Strength card and the Empress. Okay. So this person is holding back. This person is holding back and trying to stay in their power. Because they are so much conflicted from inside. I do see this person feels like coming towards you. But they are holding back and trying to show you that they don't care about you. Or they don't have any effect on the, on the, like, of this relationship on them. Or they just don't care about you. Or they are just showing you that uh, they don't need you basically but internally this person is very very conflicted from inside Internal, uh, internally this person feels like to bring the stability on the table but again i do see this person is very conflicted from inside so there's something that is stopping them from coming towards you some kind of blockages are there you know so you could be dealing with a leo could be dealing with a taurus virgo capricorn aries leo sagittarius let's see what you feel for this person aries your feelings for them right now let's see justice okay Aries you're, you're trying to bring balance to the situation you could be dealing with the Libra you're trying to do justice with the situation so you feel like uh, if they did something wrong with you you want to serve the justice in a, in a right manner if they did something beautiful with you you feel like you should return the favor in, in like in their favor you're just trying to bring balance to the situation by doing justice with your own emotions with your own feelings right so let's start clarifying let's see let's clarify the justice as your feelings for them the hermit the world the page of pentacles okay you have accepted that this connection is not working out or this is the end of a cycle i do see you're trying to think about the situation you know from a logical level from a mental emotional and spiritual level so you feel like uh, this is a connection where things are going to be you know if if they are not completed right now a cycle is completed a phase is completed and a, a renewed phase is started so you're starting from scratch this is what you're doing you're starting from a friendship level from a you know kind of friendship level kind of scratch level you're like i'm going to start from a level where it is just plain friendship nothing else right now okay because things are not going well between you guys from a very long time now you want to do justice you are trying to understand things and complete up you know chapter with this person and restarting a new one with friendship with maturity you know although page of page pages are not mature at all but you are taking a mature decision to start from scratch you know to start from a plain slate clean slate you can say also uh, taurus virgo capricorn and virgo and libra energy let's see what this person wants from you there is let's see what this person wants from you lovers okay they want you to take some kind of decision regarding the situation between you guys they feel there's a soulmate connection they feel there's lust there's attraction there's love everything is there but they want you to take some kind of decision regarding the situation or they are the one who want to take the decision like there's a decision this is that is pending between you guys and they want you to take that decision okay make up a mind regarding the situation gemini energy let me clarify the lovers card as what they want from you the death yes and the five of pentacles and the moon see i told you this person wants you to take a decision regarding the situation because things have ended and both of you are feeling some kind of loss this is the end of the situation end of a cycle both of you are feeling the, some kind of loss uh, especially the other person is feeling like you have uh, you know you have betrayed them or you have done something very wrong with them uh, it could be it could be them and there is something you know this connection is sinking down and down and this connection is going down and down it's like 
there is disappointment there is uh, blockages in the communication there is blockage in the intuition uh, there is constant negative thinking about the situation there is and there is betrayal there is hell lot of negativity and toxicity around this connection right now and this person wants you to decide what to do next what next this is what they want you to do they want you to clarify what next you are going to do about the situation or what is your next step or what is you are thinking what you are thinking about the situation let me see what you want from this connection iris let's see what you want from this connection right now like in june from 1st to 10 high priestess okay iris again this is the card you want justice you want libra you have uh, the justice card you have the high priestess so you are thinking and you have the uh, hermit card as well so again i feel like you want time you want space you want the, you want to understand exactly where this connection is right now what is the status of this connection you want this connection or not you want to leave this person forever you want this person to calm down and relax and think logically you know take a break and think logically and understand each and everything about the situation this is what you want from this person from this connection so let me clarify the high priestess four of pentacles the tower and the nine of wands yeah you want to hold back you don't want to say anything you don't want to react to the situation and this is unexpected it's like out of the out of you know out of nowhere you can say or out uh, all of a sudden you realize that i don't want to say anything to this person i just want to be single i just want to focus on my money my job my career my enhancement my self love self care self healing so you want nothing out nothing from this person you want just you know you, you want this person to take a break and remain silent and just understand things from a mature point of view and you are just suddenly like suddenly you are feeling this need to be single and just focus on yourself your money your business everything about you everything about your situation right this is what you want i'm doing like i'm i did the whole reading like this okay i'm drunk with what <laughs> so yes this is what you want from the situation you want to come out of this situation and focus on yourself only so the signs that i'm getting here is a uh, taurus virgo capricorn pisces taurus virgo capricorn scorpio okay let's see what uh, the universe has for you like uh, what is the outcome of the situation till the 10th of june university is guide me nine of cups okay some kind of, kind of wish fulfillment might be this is a wish fulfillment that you should focus on yourself and self love and healing that is coming to you some kind of wish fulfillment is coming towards you it could be personally it could be professionally professionally but whatever it is it is going to make you really happy it's going to expand your heart chakra and it is going to you know make you feel uh, very good Ma make you feel like lighter let me clarify yep the lovers the page of cups and the knight of wands i feel like there will be a decision that will be made regarding the situation and there will be a brand new start in the connection okay it could be something it could be also it, it could also mean that you are going to get connected to somebody new and that somebody new is going to make you feel very good about you about the situation about the connection but i don't see commitment i do see attraction i do see somebody young or a young energy or a past energy with young feelings or new feelings is coming towards you with an apology might be and there is some kind of uh, sexual uh, energies coming your way or some kind of a uh, very powerful energy coming towards your way you know sexually i can say so it it is like i feel like sexually it is going to be a very good time uh, for you uh, you could be moving on from a past situation and stepping into something new with love not love sorry with no, not with love with the fire okay fire this is what i'm getting here so whatever it is it is going to make you really happy so let's pull two cards for the angel messages for you opportunity yes some kind of opportunity is coming your way i told you this is some kind of new energy or young energy coming your way and then you have to look for a sign look for a sign from the universe just look for the sign this is plain and simple so thank you so much for tuning in i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste